Hello everybody and thank you for coming to watch this video about the Calder Pips Tone Halo. Um, the Tone Halo is a brass ring which fits onto the bell of the trombone to change some of the char characteristics of the instrument and to enhance the uh, focus and definition of the sound primarily. Um, it's a brass ring made out of the finest UK um, brass uh, which is used for making mouthpieces and instruments. Um, we cover the inside of it with leather to stop any sort of uh, scratching of your instrument and you'll see that it has a gap in the ring which is how we put it on and off to the instrument. So um, I'm going to start with my alto trombo. No uh, triggers or any other gubbins getting in the way. So if you just find the gap on your halo and you pop it over the bell of the trombone and push it down and at the point where it starts to grip onto the trombone give it a good firm squeeze not too much so you damage the instrument obviously so that it will stay in place and there it's in place to play this is the same as if you were fitted to a small ball trombone like a king 3b or a con 6h or a bark 12 something of that nature um, this is a seven inch bell um, so it's exactly the same um, when you fit it to a smaller bell, you may find that there's a tiny gap on one side or the other um, when you give it a squeeze. Um, we can sometimes fit some thicker leather for that, but we found that it's better to use this 1.2, 1.3 millimeter leather. It gives the best interface. Um, and if there is a small gap there, don't worry about it. The ring will still do its job. You'll feel the difference immediately anyway. So that's how we'd fit it to the alto. And then to take it off, just give it a little twist up and off the bell. So um, I'll just show you on the tenor next. So this is a Con 88H with a green hole valve. Um, so it's pretty standard, eight and a half inch bell tenor. Um, exactly the same. Where you see the gap there over the bell, pop it down. And when it starts there, give it a squeeze on and it's in place. And that's it. And exactly the same to take it off. Uh, there, up and off. Um, and then finally I'll just show you on my bass. So this is an Edwards bass trombone um, and uh, it has a 10 inch bell um, which is quite large but I think the size of the top is obviously exactly the same coming out of the tuning slide. So just find the point just underneath the tuning slide, find the gap in the ring, pop it over the bell, push it down and where you find that it starts to push onto the bell give it a little squeeze and there it's in place. Um, and you will feel the difference straight away on the instrument when you start to play it. What you'll find is that there'll be more focus and more definition to the sound. When you're trying to play very, very loud, the sound won't break up as quickly. So you can play louder, not that any of us should ever get to that sort of volume, of course. Um, and what I find with this, on, particularly on the bass trombone, on the tenor trombone, the larger trombones, is when you're trying to play quiet and in the low register, it makes the articulations really easy. Um, so that's the biggest thing that I found. Um, with the ring and that was one of the reasons that we created it was that I wanted to be in a scenario where I wanted a heavy bell but I didn't want to have to switch bells all the time between trombones so um, instead of having to swap um, the bell from a heavy to a light I can literally just put this ring on and I've got that in 10 seconds so literally I can put the ring over on that's it play when I've finished up off and I'm back to my standard bell. So there we are. So that's the Calder Pips Tone Halo. Um, thank you very much for watching the video. If you've got any questions or you'd like to order one, please just send us an email. We'd be really pleased to hear from you. Um, thank you very much.